Hello, Just Too Good here, back from my review, and today we're reviewing LEGO set number 40155. It's the Piggy Coin Bank. It has 148 pieces. It retails for $15 in the United States, and this is a LEGO store exclusive for 2015. So now let's take a look at the build itself. So here is this Piggy Coin Bank. Very cool design and very nice techniques used to kind of give it that, that circular design that you'd expect from a Piggy Coin Bank. It works well, and it looks well, and it comes with a lot of great pieces for the $15 price point. Now, I'll just compare this to the size of a regular minifigure. Right here, I got Twitch, and you can see it is quite big, so I kind of like how they did that. Uh, my favorite part is really just the front face and how they did this, because if you see right here, uh, they use little, little sausages as the eyebrows, and they have these wacky eyes right here, which are on these little swivel things. They're the mixel eyes, but they're on these modif the little plates with the swivel parts in them, so you could put him having different uh, little, little uh, eye directions right there. He looks a little bit derpy there. And then he even has a little snout right there, which uses those modified circular tile pieces with the little hole in the middle. So that comes out very well, and you could even take off the face quite easily, but I'm not sure why you'd like to do that. And you could just kind of easily reattach it like that. And his ears right here actually are on these mini ball joints, so you could put them in different directions if you'd like. So that's really fun to play with the face. Now, like I said, there's a great kind of design with this whole thing all around because they use a lot of different layers of these big solid bricks to give it that nice kind of round look to it. Now, the main function of the Piggy Coin Bank works quite well. It's not perfect, but uh, I just have this regular American Quarter right here. And you can see you just put it in there and bam. I mean, it could fit for American coins. I'm pretty sure it could fit just about every coin out there because um, I know it could fit half a dollar. So that's really cool. But uh, you got a lot of room inside there. But my main complaint with this is it's kind of hard to open this. There's no easy way to remove the top. Now, you may think this is um, more of the traditional piggy coin bank style because back in the older ones, not really from Lego, but just in general piggy coin banks, you would have to open them by smashing them on the floor. So... It's not that hard to open it because, um, you know, you just have to remove these little layers of bricks. But I wish there would have been maybe a plate that easily lifts off. But you can see you could fit quite a lot of coins in there. So that works out very, very well. Um, there's not much else inside there, though. But, of course, there's necessary room for more coins than just this one that I put in there. Now, looking at the back, or we could just easily reapply it like that. But looking at the back, they have this nice corkscrew tail, which they used some Technic pieces for, and I think that works pretty well. It's all swiveling just on this one Technic pin, uh, or the, the modified brick with the Technic pin sticking out, but uh, it gives it a nice authentic look, and it's a very simple look. So I like how that came out, very creative. And on the bottom, you even got these little circular uh, bricks right here, uh, which are actually used for his little legs, and I think that worked out very, very well. Very clever, very stable and it, it just stands up very, very cool. So that's really it. I would have preferred maybe if they had an opening on the bottom or something like that to easily remove coins, but for the good price it has, a $15 price point, um, you know, I, I really think they executed this very well. So we'll take a look at the box and then the final verdict. Here's the box and the back, and then there's one instruction booklet that really doesn't have much content to it other than building steps. So that's it for the Piggy Coin Bank. Definitely a great set for kids and adults alike. I'm really loving this line of uh, store exclusive sets like the Pencil Pot set, this one and the Birthday Cake one. And they're really proving to be popular because they keep on selling out at my local Lego store. For the $15 price point, it has a nice fun design that's authentic to a Piggy Coin Bank. Besides maybe not having that traditional pink color, but I think the red looks fine. And it also has a great function of storing coins. My only complaint is it's a little bit hard to remove the coins. And also, the building for it was a little bit confusing because of all the red colors. But I like that they included a lot of red bricks in there for the $15 price point. And I will give this set an A because it's just really fun to play around with the face and store coins and everything. And the build itself is very sturdy and very well built and it functions just as it should. So that's it for now. Hope you guys enjoyed this review. And you guys could leave your comments down below. And I'll see you guys later.